<laughs> I'm putting on an acrobatic display. Ricardo Banderas. This is Big Rich. Yeah. They're breeze into it now. What have you got? I've got four, but I might go to a little, little buffer. A little gentleman's out. persuader. Well, I'm going to hit the four iron. And on the tee, in the inaugural four hole championship. Lafferty of... Daniel. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Ricardo. Hola, Tomola. All right. Your pleasure to. Pleasure to be in your presence this again, mate. This is nice. This is nice. This, this is the first time since pre-South Africa, isn't it? Mm. We're going to have a four-hole match stroke play. Championship. How's your game, Rich? Um, from 400 yards to 20 yards, I'm, I feel good. I feel very good. What about inside? I feel under the level <laughs> of where I need to be. Spirit level. One, two, six. That's One, two, six. That's what you play a cut, mate. Start splitting the fairways. A bit of breeze into... Probably like two down. Probably playing around 130. And where's the room on this? The room is behind it. Behind it and left of it? Behind it, yeah. Behind it and left of it. But that pin's sort of like centre of the green, isn't it? Yeah. So, you're going to go just left of it. I'd be trying to score a goal between the pin and the marker there. Don't spin, don't spin. A little shy. Harry Flower has joined us. Well, that's proof that your divots are going left, I suppose. That's a. What's that, you are? Ha! Ha, Caspar! Ricardo Sanchez. How far has he got? We don't know yet. We're throwing our lies at it because it's still a bit. Still a bit moist. It's 116 pin, 128 back. Are we playing in 125? I'm, gonna, I'm, my, I'm in a good solid gap, which is a 122. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get past more pins, to be honest. So, strike, yep. clipped it. That's it. Oh, Rich is in there with a putt for birdie. Ricardo Banderas. The Sword Slayer. What are you classing that as? Is that a, is that a brook? I think, well, in, in Afrikaans, they call it a schloot. A schloot. A schloot. A schloot. So that's what I'm going to be calling Fantastic. every single one from now on. It's in the schloot. <laughs> I've had some brown water come out of my schloot before. <laughs> James has forgotten in the, uh, the Kikuya-like uh, fringes of Dainton Park. So he's coming up the hill. Little tiny bit, not crazy amounts. Yeah, day of growth, warm and a bit wet. Good try. Oh, you can finish it if you like, but I'll give you that. All right. That's a gimme. I'm feeling generous. <laughs> left centre. Just inside left. Ricardo Sanchez Banderas Woods. Lines up a five footer for birdie on the first hole. Can he stroke it home? Oh, wow. Wowzers. I think I made a mess in my trays. All right, second hole at Dainton. It is 326 to those trees at the end, 310 ish to the firs. And it's about a two, 265 carry, yeah. so it's just. Driving. It's pretty wet out here still, as we're still uh, drying out. So it pretty much is the play, just driver, uh, and it should be just short of those trees at the end. Rich should be nicely in the middle. What game you're talking? I'm thinking about getting over the water. <laughs> Shot. Tad toe, or is that no, all right? Really nice. That was. Ooh. That's comfortable, sir. Comfortable. Just carried it by five yards. It's so comfortable that you had to look at it like... <laughs> to be fair, I was looking at it because it's I don't hit many draws. <laughs> Just appreciating the draw. Yeah. 
nothing to do with the 15 mile an hour right to left wind. <laughs> yeah, nice move. Very good. Thanks, mate. Oh, I like that cut. Two good tee shots. Back left flag. Back left flag, indeed. Straight down wind, pretty much, from here. How far? I've got 100 on the nose. What is that for you? Gap? Uh, no, no. Uh, sorry. <laughs> 50, 53? No, I've got 58. 58 is like a, is like a 90, 500 yard shot. Um, and I don't really want to ease in 54 because it brings long in. So I think this is a this is right. Go. I had 100 on the nose. Yeah. You're gonna have virtually the same. Right, 58 degree, which is just under 100. So it should be almost like, almost like full out feel. Nice. Dog. And that is where it is personal preference, isn't it? Because I would always go for the one that I can play a bit more full. Yeah. Whereas you're, you're going to play it. Full, yeah. Yeah. As soon as I start taking speed and length off it, I I feel a little uncomfortable. Yeah. I don't know what it is with the 58 or 60 degree. I've got a 58. As soon as it gets to that loft, I just feel like I can't swing more than three quarters and have any control. That's just like the feeling. So I usually don't hit it more than 90. I just felt like I had to hit that probably just out of what I'm comfortable with. And a 53 just flights it in a bit lower and it's a bit more accurate. So probably should have hit that. Well, um, I, I usually uh, hole about 84% from this area. So um, I would uh, probably hole it because I'm off 27 and play on a Wednesday morning with my friend Jeff. Straight up the hill and it's uh, 5 p.m. on Sunday. So... No, it's 6 p.m. on Sunday, so not going to be quick. Not going to be that slow. Oh, oh I thought you hold it. Just outside the right edge? A bit more than that. Not a lot of the A bit more than that, he says. Hello. Ah, oh, enough, big pony. We had the reed. Oh, just on the left edge. Ooh. Shouldn't do too much. Yeah, nicely done. Good putt. What are these, Rich? They, they will be mallard ducks. Mallards? Mallards. And the, the females are boring and brown. And the males are flamboyant with... Um, what, what green is that? Emerald green? And here we have two mallard ducks sunbathing on the edge of the water. Their emerald green necks show that they are in fine vigour and full of testosterone. <laughs> the fact that they are sandwiching a female duck <laughs> also uh, suggests they are looking quite vigorous. <laughs> sandwiching? Oh yeah. She is there. Oh look. It's the DP World Tour. Far five. Oh, about 500, yeah, 500 yards. Yeah, 500 ish. Yeah, that's me. A little squeeze up. It's got to not be on the little upslope. That's the only thing with you in driver here. Oh, yes. Rich got the draws going. Look at that. And now we have some competition as some rival mallards are putting on an acrobatic display. Fantastic. One of the mallard ducks took the female out for a lovely dinner. He didn't have any cash with him, so he said to the waiter, just put it on my bill. How far, Banderos? Two, two, two. <laughs> that sounds like a Mexican machine gun. <laughs> two, 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 two. Up here, into like breezes. Yeah, breeze is like into off the left, so it's probably 10 up. Like right. Two, two, like two, two, it's two, a really, 230. really, really good five wood. About 245 shot. Yeah, like five wood's 235. Three wood's like 250. So I'm going to hit three wood because there's a lot of green behind it. Nearly 
nearly missed the ball. I'd nearly missed it. Who were? Who were? That's close. Oh, in the, that's in where the wild things live. Schlutes be sluting in there, mate. <laughs> 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 we got a bit of a fly a lie here for the second shot. In there, James, is um, our homage to Stonehenge. Apparently, same designer. The Druids. Gary. <laughs> Gary, the, the stonemason. 210, 10 up, 220, and then I've got the biggest flyer. So it's like, without a flyer, this is probably probably a four iron but with a fly it's probably a six so I'm not going to play for a fade this time I'm just going to start it straight because it's not going to spin I'm just going to try and start this just left of the pin needs to go forward a bit nah sure 15 20 shots it's a lot of wind against I think just heavy a bit heavy as well I think you could have hit well definitely five I think but I think five it's fine though five or six Chance to show your scintillating short game, sir. It's pretty sick right now. So James is about 15 yards short of the green. And he's got about 15, 20 feet of green to work with. You got most lofted? 58. 58. So going to land it on? A little bit against the wind, which probably helps as well. Strike that's nice. That's really well played. Very nice. <laughs> there are celebrations happening. Celebrating the fact that I didn't hit it three yards. Look, it's right here. Beautiful. What's the lie? Yeah. Ooh, that's, that's a bit more of an issue. Not too bad. Not bit of, too bad. It's a little. Bit of ground under there. Yeah. Just going to have to be a bit short and stabby. Not that your action was ever flowing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not much green to work with. So it's just one of them, really. You're just trying to. Land this around the fringe green area and just accept what result you get. God gives you. It's just flew under. I'm not really sure yeah. what happened with this strike there. Pardon? It didn't. No, I, I do get that one occasionally. Okay? What is that strike? Is that like where the face is slid, really wide? Yeah, like slid underneath it. I feel like I actually struck it quite well. Right, much easier shot now. Nice bit of tufty grass to play off. Just trying to play like a little tiny floater just landing on the green, I expect. That's better. Ooh. Got unlucky there because that kicked on really hard. Yeah, yeah it played it better. Putt for par. It's a big putt here, jump. Just on the the left edge. Needs this to stay in the match. Oh, it's clutch. Stays in it. What are you? Level. And level par. Level and one under. Juan. So we've got one, was it one four? One four, um, one, no, one three seven. Plus ten is a Ronnie. And then wind is like there. So it's like not really helping. No. I'm thinking, I'm thinking a little nine actually. That's got to go. That felt really good. Okay. It's a nice shot. Full, Full nine? Yeah, most of a nine. I'm not like walloping it. It is most of a nine. Wallop. Nice strike. Just faded a bit. Yeah, yeah. back right. It's a pretty good shot. Yeah, it's probably pretty nice. And here we are on the fourth hole of the Crucible. And who's furthest away? I don't know. That is the question, because Rich is one back. I think it's pretty even, but I'll Are let you play. Ready? I'll let you play down first, mate. This is big, Rich. Yeah. A chip. Big. A chip or a putt. A chip's got more chance of going in. A putt's got more chance of making three, and I'm one behind. I. A putt's easier to not fat. <laughs> I'm chipping it! I'm chipping it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm chipping it. What are you chipping it with? 54. Little dip dab dob. 
one shot, one opportunity. <laughs> Probably, I'm more likely to get vomit on my sweater. <laughs> yeah, you won't be seizing, you'll just be having a seizure. Oh, if he <laughs> left the flagging! I'm such a jab jib job. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Yippee ki yay, mother. <laughs> so straight as up. What a wonderful face control. Oh. Of the leading edge. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was going to jam as well. This could spell the end for Happy Gilmore. Stay up. That's just a fantastic butt. Oh, he's just gonna... <laughs> Nicely done, James. Thanks for the game, mate. Well done. Thank you for that Thank four holes. Much. Shark attack. Right, cheers for watching, guys. Back with more course flags. Course flags! Course vlogs soon. Full length ones, 9 or 18. See you again soon.